Okay, start. We're on. You're on. About what? The Pharisees. Yeah, I like. I have to have like a big, like compressed history lesson that to even like go into it. It's pretty deep subject. <laughs> Before the Allah's Messenger may peace be upon him, visited a person from amongst the Muslims in order to inquire about his health, who had grown feeble like a chicken. Allah's Messenger may peace be upon him said, Did you supplicate for anything or beg of him about that? He said, Yes. I used to utter these words. Impose punishment upon me. Oh, that's it. Impose punishment upon me earlier in this world. What thou art going to impose upon me in the hereafter? Thereupon Allah's messenger, may peace be upon him, said, Hallowed be Allah, you have neither the power nor forbearance to take upon yourself the burden of his punishment. Why did you not say this? O oh Allah, grant us good in the world and good in the hereafter, and save us from the torment of fire. He, the Holy Prophet, made this supplication for him, and he was all right. such power and authority. You have so much power and authority in, in your voice. tell you that Abu Huraira reported that Allah's apostle may peace be upon him and saying Allah has mobile squads of angels who have no other work to attend to but to follow the assemblies of dikr and when they find such assemblies in which there is dikr of Allah 
they sit in them and some of them surround the others with their wings till the space between them and the sky uh, of the world is fully covered and when they disperse after the assembly of Dicher is adjourned they go upward to the heaven of Allah the exalted and glorious asks them although he is best informed about them where have you come from they say we have come from thine servants upon the earth who have been glorifying thee reciting subhanallah uttering thine greatness saying allahu akbar and uttering thine oneness la ilaha il allah and praising thee uttering alhamdulillah and begging of thee be he would say what do they beg of me they would say they beg of thee the paradise of thine he god would say have they seen my paradise they said no our lord he would say what it would be then if they were to see mine paradise they the angels said they seek thine protection he the lord would say against what do they seek protection of mine they the angels would say our lord from the hell fire he the lord would say have they seen my fire they would say no he the lord would say what it would be if they were to see my fire they would say they beg of thee forgiveness he would say i grant pardon to them and confer upon them what they ask for and grant them protection against which they seek protection they the angels would again say our lord there is one amongst them that such and such a simple servant who hasn't happened to pass by the assembly and sat there along with them who had been participating in the assembly he the lord would say i also grant him pardon for they are a people the seat fellows of whom are in no way unfortunate. Whew! That was a long, that was a lengthy hadith. Wow! Well, wow. I got, I'm printing out more. Wow! My mind! Get back to those Pharisees now. 